imagine a mighty battleship with hard armor and powerful primary armament that's been constructed specially for you. Even though this ship was never destined to fire salvos and destroy enemies out at sea, you can make it all happen in our game. Please welcome Soviet battleship Lenin. At the beginning of 1936, two Soviet shipbuilding design bureaus started work on a tender project under the name Baltic Sea Battleship, which was later renamed Project 21. At that time, the standard displacement of a ship had to be no more than 35,000 tons. This was due to both the technical issues that existed for ships of larger dimensions and existing restrictive political treaties. The Soviet government had decided to negotiate a peace treaty with the United Kingdom. It meant that ship designs had to confirm to the London Treaty on limiting naval armament. The treaty stated the requirements clearly. The displacement of battleships shouldn't exceed 35,000 tons. It was possible to stay within these limits and preserve the firepower of a ship by decreasing the length of its armored citadel. One example of such a design was British battleship Nelson, which had all three of her artillery turrets, totaling nine 406 mm guns located at her forward end. It was exactly this concept that was used as the basis for development in the design bureau of the Baltic factory in Leningrad. But after prolonged discussions, the USSR Navy declined it. However, it has been brought to life in our game, receiving both its virtual embodiment as a Tier 8 premium ship and its name, Battleship Lenin. While playing with Soviet battleships, it's advised to apply an offensive strategy because these ships perform better at close and medium ranges. They have decent armor, which is especially effective against HE shells, and carry powerful guns with good penetration capabilities. Let's go into a little more detail about our ship. Battleship Lenin is very effective at pushing in a particular direction. When doing so, she can take some heavy punishment if angled right. As her armor soaks up hits, you'll be afforded an opportunity to counter and penetrate the citadels of any enemy battleships. It's possible to cause terminal damage with a single salvo from medium ranges. One should remember that the battleship has quite a modest consumable set, only repair party and damage control party. The former is the same as for other ships, while the features of her damage control party are quite special and we need to discuss them separately. Her damage control party has quite a long cooldown that allows you to defend yourself against fire, flooding and primary armament breakdowns in fast-moving fights at close quarters. But it's important to remember that the number of uses of this consumable is limited. The most dangerous enemies for Lenin aren't the Tsar and the bourgeoisie, but destroyers and aviation from aircraft carriers. That's why it's better to head into battle supported by allies who are able to effectively defend against enemy aviation and also spot torpedoes. Soviet battleship Lenin can take a great deal of punishment and hit back hard to inflict an enormous amount of damage to enemies. All you need to do is master and control the nuances of the ship. I hope you manage to do so, captains.